Okay. Um, here's a little tutorial on Microsoft Word. Um, we're just going to create a new document with some blank text. Here you, you see all different types of templates. Um, you can get some even online. Um, so I was just going to uh, let's create something from the template. Let's do um, do birthday card. You click on birthday card. And you click here's the description of it. And you click on create. And Microsoft will download the template. And over here was just type some text. Happy birthday. Okay. Let's um, center the text and change the font. To do that, you put your mouse cursor here. And, and select it. Up here is where you do your font. Um, you can do control, shift, and F to bring up the font dialog. Let's use Arial for font. Let's do bold italic. Let's do 28 point. And then click on OK. This is what it looks like. Um, you also can change colors. What you do, you select the check set that you want to change colors. Click on font color, click on this drop down, well, click here, and it'll change the uh, text to red. You select birthday, and click on this down arrow, and you, click, and you select the color. Um, let's see, we do it blue. Okay, so you got this created. Um, now what you want to do is save it. To save it, you click on File and Save. And we're just going to save it to our computer. So we click on Computer and click Browse. And we're going to save it in our documents. And you notice right here the file name. Um, I'm just going to leave it as the file. You can save it as the type. You've got several types here. So I'm going to just with it like it is and then click on save. Okay, it's saved. Um, those up here you got other options you got save, undo, redo, email it, spell check it. You can print preview it, we'll spell check it. To do that you click on the ABC check mark or just hit F7. It says you get a dialog box saying spelling and grammar check okay you're good to go mm -hmm. now let's say we want to print it mm -hmm. you click on print you click on file and print mm -hmm. this is what the previous one you look on to print you just click on print but I'm not going to print for this tutorial um, okay, let's open up another document. To open up another document, you press, click on File, Open. I don't want to click on Computer, click Browns, and you find the document I can open. And here's the document. Let me talk about this little tab up here. This is your home tab. You got your paste command. You got your cut, copy, format, painter, your fonts. Um, your font you want to use the size, the color. You, you highlight, highlight, make it bold, italicize. And you can underline it. You can subscript it. Over here, you got bullets. You can make bullet points. Here you got numbering. Here you got a multi level list. This, this area here is good for outlining. Here's like your alignment. Over here is like your headings. Let's create a new document and I'll um, demonstrate the headings. So, create a new document. 
Press back, click on file, new. And this time I'm clicking on that white document. And we're on the normal layout. So let's go to title. And give the title of the title to the um, Then you select uh, a style, it'll automatically format the font, the sizing. There's more ways you can do it. Um, you can save it. You can stop right now and save it. But I'm for the sake of this tutorial, I'm not going to do it. Here's the insert tab. You can insert a cover page, a blank page, a table, a picture, a long line picture. Let's insert an online picture. And what kind of picture do you want to use? Do something outdoors. So, you got free sources, you got office.com, flip art, being image search, and if you have a one, one drive account, so one drive account, you can. So, let's try office.com, flip art, and we're going to try outdoor. Sorry about the um, feedback. And, and then this is use this long chair. No wait a minute, let's use this picnic table. Click on there and click on insert and we can drag it around here. You can press enter and move it down. Notice it all the tab all goes all the way goes back to the home tab. Um, we got a design tab, we got different designs, you got different themes. Um, you got your page layout tab, this is where you set up your margins. Um, you got narrow, you got normal. Um, you got your orientation, you can use to do a portrait or landscape. You got size, 8.5 by 11, 11 by 17, legal. And we got references. This is good for term papers, research papers. This is mailings. This is this is your mailing tab. This is where you set up envelopes and labels. This is your review pack tab. You put, here's your spelling and grammar. Here's your define, for SARS, word count, plan, weight, language, and other commands. Here's your view command. Got reading view. Uh, go back. I'm trying to get back. And basically, this is what the Microsoft tutorial more uh, looks like and does. There's more stuff. Um, and research online or any other stuff about Microsoft Word that you want.